in our case, uh, of which the ruling uh, was published in November, there was a person called WM, who was called Patrick Hansen by the press, who was also caught up in the Pandora Papers investigation and whose ownership was revealed, argued in front of the court that making his name public violates his privacy and the protection of personal data. So this Mr. Hansen, who is the chief executive of a private jet company, owned a holding company in the British Virgin Islands with activities in Luxembourg, Cyprus, and Russia, and assets valued at more than 3 million US dollars, and also co-owned company registered in Central American tax haven valleys. So he is the one who argued for his privacy in relation to access to business ownership data. And then fortunately, the court accepted this reasoning and the ruling states that the law, this original uh, fifth anti-money laundering directive, does not appropriately balance privacy and public access, and that public access was not sufficiently justified in the law. So the ruling still underlines that civil society organizations and the press have legitimate interest in accessing the information on beneficial ownership, but not the general public. And guess what? As an imminent response, Austria, Belgium, Luxembourg and the Netherlands have already shut down access to their registers. So the EU legislators must react to this situation.